you have atrial fibrillation and your doctor said that you need uh, an atrial fibrillation ablation and you probably have heard about pulmonary vein antrum isolation or commonly known as PVAI which is essentially the ablation for atrial fibrillation. Now what does it mean and what do we do for an atrial fibrillation ablation? If we look at the back of the heart where the left atrium is so if this is the left atrium, and for reasons that we do not understand, atrial fibrillation comes from electrical activity that starts in the pulmonary vein and goes to the left atrium. So the idea of doing an AFib ablation is to block this electrical activity from coming to the left atrium. So that's very easy. All we do is we go in with catheters into the veins, and that takes us to the right atrium. We cross from the right atrium to the left atrium. So if this is the heart here, we go into the right atrium, cross to the left atrium, and now we're looking at the back of the left atrium here. And all we do is we do ablation at the opening or the antrum of the pulmonary vein, all four of them, to block the electrical activity from the pulmonary vein to reach the left atrium. This does not interfere with the blood flow from the pulmonary vein that drain blood from the lungs to the heart. It does not interfere with the blood flow. It only disconnects electrically the veins from the left atrium. And that is the basic concept of an atrial fibrillation ablation. Now, additional ablation in the left atrium can be done in patients who have atrial flutter or in patients who we think that this electrical activity comes from areas other than the pulmonary veins, and these usually require additional mapping and additional ablation.